what would I do without your smile now? Drawing me in and you kicking me out. Got my head spinning, no kidding, I can't pin you down. On behalf of Colby and Marissa, I welcome you to this day of joy and celebration. We are gathered here today in the presence of friends and loved ones to celebrate one of life's greatest moments and to give recognition to the worth and beauty of your love, Colby and Marissa, as you exchange your vows of love and commitment. Marriage is a commitment to life, the best that two people can find and bring out in each other. It offers opportunities for sharing and growth that no other relationship can equal. It is a union that is promised for a lifetime. Marriage deepens and enriches every facet of life. Happiness is fuller, memories are fresher, and commitment is stronger. Married love understands and forgives the mistakes that life is unable to avoid. It encourages new ways of expressing a love that is deeper than life. When two people pledge their love for each other in marriage, they create a spirit unique unto themselves, which binds them closer than any spoken or written words. Marriage is a promise, a potential made in the hearts of two people who love each other, and it takes a lifetime to fulfill. Marriage is not a destination, but a journey. Today, before these witnesses, you proclaim your love and commitment to the world. And so I ask that you turn toward one another and hold hands. And if someone will take the flowers. Colby, do you take Marissa to be your wedded wife, to live together in marriage? Do you promise to love her, comfort her, and honor her in sickness and in health? in sorrow and in joy, forsaking all others so long as you both shall live. If yes. Perfect. He knew his line. <laughs> <laughs> Marissa, do you take Colby to be your wedded husband, to live together in marriage? Do you promise to love him, comfort him, and honor him in sickness and in health, in sorrow and in joy, forsaking all others so long as you both shall live? I do. Okay. Today, I commit myself to you. Today, I commit myself to you. I choose you above all others. Choose you above all others. To share this life with me. To share this life with me. I promise to love and respect you. I promise to love and respect you. To honor and care for you. To honor and care for you. When life seems easy. When life seems easy. And when it seems difficult. And when it seems difficult. I give you all of my love and trust. I give you all of my love and trust. And ask that you accept me. And ask that you accept me. Through all the changes of our lives. Through all the changes of our lives. Marissa, your turn. <laughs> Today I commit myself to you. Today I commit myself to you. I choose you above all others. I choose you above all others. To share this life with me. To share this life with me. I promise to love and respect you. I promise to love and respect you. To honor and care for you. To honor and care for you. When life seems easy. When life seems easy. And when it seems difficult. And when it seems difficult. I give you all of my love and trust. I give you all of my love and trust. And ask that you accept me. And ask that you accept, accept me. Through all the changes of our lives. Through all the changes of our lives. Okay. Now the rings. I'll take those. These rings mark the beginning of an adventure filled with wonder, surprises, laughter, tears, celebration, grief, and joy. They symbolize your two lives now joined in one unbroken circle. Wear them always as a visible reminder of your vows of love and commitment. I give this ring. I give this ring. As my gift to you. As my gift to you. Wear it and think of me. Wear it and think of me. And know that I love you. And know that I love you. Marissa, take his ring. Colby, extend your left hand. And Marissa, repeat after me. I give this ring. I give this ring. As my gift to you. As my gift to you. Wear it and think of me. Wear it and think of me. And know that I love you. And know that I love you. Colby and Marissa, as you pledge to each other to be loving friends and partners in marriage, to talk and to listen, to trust and appreciate one another, to respect and cherish each other's uniqueness, and to support, comfort, and strengthen each other through life's joys and sorrows. May your lives be ever intertwined, your love keeping you together. 
May your home be forever filled with peace, happiness, and love. Colby and Marissa, in so much as the two of you have agreed together to live together in marriage, have promised your love for each other by these vows, the giving of these rings, and the joining of your hands, I now declare you to be husband and wife. You may kiss. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, may I present to you for the first time as husband and wife, Mr. and Mrs. Colby and Marissa McBride. We love you, Colby and Marissa. My baby boy. <laughs> Little baby boy is married. Oh, don't cry, Darcy. That's my job. Hey, congratulations, Colby and Marissa. Love you. Today is a very special day for Marissa and Colby, and I'm really happy for them. I think I remember their first date. Marissa asked me if she should wear this dress, and I said, that's way too low cut, honey. <laughs> Maybe you should change. And I agree totally with everything my wife said because that's the way of the world. <laughs>